head to head. That's what went down earlier this evening as the mayoral candidates for Nashville took part in a debate sponsored by News Channel 5. Well, thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Rory Johnston. Yeah, the field is down to just two candidates, Freddie O'Connell and Alice Rowley. News Channel 5's Araceli Crescencio tonight breaks down the different issues and visions these two have for Nashville. For a fourth and final in the Nashville mayoral debate series. It's an outcome many saw coming, a runoff race to determine who will be the city's next mayor. Out of a crowded field of candidates, Freddie O'Connell and Alice Rowley remain. Tonight, during a News Channel 5 sponsored debate, the two had a chance to make their final appeal to voters. I've been for 20 years a neighborhood leader, a nonprofit leader, transit and advocacy leader, uh, and I've been a software and technology professional. I love Nashville, and that's why I've worked so long on ensuring that we have the tools to build a better future. If you are worried about the direction of our city, if you are worried what special interests of all of the downtown crowds, of webs of relationships that stop making sense to you, a viewer, to the voters, I'd ask you to look at our campaign. During the August 3rd election, O'Connell received just over 27% of the vote, while Rowley garnered 20%. Both of them are now looking to obtain 50% plus one vote. As for how they plan to lead the city, the two candidates differ greatly. One example is how they feel about the status of the city's public school system. Rowley says the city is falling short in providing quality education for children. And we have 19 schools today in the bottom 5% of our state, and 11 of them have been there since 2015. Connell says while there's room for improvement, he believes a majority of students are seeing growth. We've seen our best ELA performance ever, to my understanding, from Metro Schools. Um, these are great things and they should be celebrated. <laughs> On license plate readers, O'Connell isn't sold on the idea without more conversations, while Rowley supports their use. On affordable housing, taxes and transit, both candidates also have different plans. Early voting starts tomorrow and on September 14th, voters will decide what ideas they best align with. In Nashville, Araceli Crescencio, News Channel 5.